out secret talks at the canteen between Matt and others. Were you a pilgrim? I know, a female pilgrim. There weren't many of us. But that's why I was so good at it. No one would recognize me as a pilgrim. Some men thought that as a woman, it would be easier to deceive me. Rob me. My fast reflexes and sharp dagger taught them otherwise. How'd you end up in Villador? I got this... Goddamn job. A guy wanted me to deliver a package to Villador. To some woman who was well known before the outbreak. Apparently she played video games professionally. Weird job, eh? Anyway, the guy paid me a lot, but on one condition. I couldn't know what was in the package. And that was my big mistake. I carried this damn thing for 50 kilometers, and with each step it got heavier. I sneaked into Villador found this woman and delivered the package. She opened it in front of me. Turned out, it was a jar, with a human head inside. Whose head? I don't really know, I got the fuck out of there right quick. Is that why you quit the life? Well, I felt that, actually, that I was constantly running away from something. Maybe from myself. This is a big city. Even a pilgrim can belong here. Nobody judges you for what you were before, like they do in the smaller towns. Who you used to be beyond the walls. What you once did. They kept you on the move. You can disappear in the city. That's how I found my place. And what about you, Aiden? Don't you want to stop running? Yeah, maybe someday. But first, I have to finish what I started here. I understand. Just remember this. You can't run away from yourself. Good luck, Pilgrim.
You're back. I thought maybe you'd given up on your lady friend. With reagents from the GRE. Is this poison? Let us see. Carefully stirring, I hold my breath. Will this heal or bring on death? Um, what was that? The kid is like that. A little rhyme to pass the time. <laughs> so, is it poison? Not at all. These are antibiotics. Why, I haven't seen antibiotics by years. So, those couldn't be used to kill anyone? Not likely. These were made by a skilled herbalist. Exceptional work. I could go on. But didn't you see someone's life hangs in the balance?
Are you all right? I'm... you know... yeah. They injected that shit into you. Who... who are... who are you? Aiden, your father sent me. Father? Ah, uh, uh, Dad. You're out of danger. I'll take you to him. No. What? I don't need you, Dad. Or anybody else. I'm doing fine here. Give me a needle. Hey, wait, 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 wait. You've got all your fingers. The bandits didn't cut one off. So it was all fake? Leave me alone. There was no kidnapping, was there? You've been tricking your own father into making you free drugs? Get out of here! How could you do that to your father? Didn't want this, okay? It's stronger than me. And now what do you want? You'd rather stay here like this than be with your father? Brooke! Son! My boy! Finally, I've got you back. What is it, boy? Are you all right? This kid's been through a lot. They shot him up with drugs. God, I, I didn't know. Come home. I'll take care of you. Everything will be fine. Thanks, Aiden. Yeah, whatever. Uh, good luck.
Gerard was a great man. He shall now live forever in our memories. Right You'll remember him every time you need friendly advice. A warm word of encouragement. Why would you even say something like that? Just kidding. You two are a match made in heaven. Why are you smiling? Every time I see you, you're worried about something. <laughs> <laughs>
Nicholas, I'm in the control room. Nice. Now just find the switch. Nicholas, the switch didn't work. Damn it. There's another way. Uh, forgive me on a try? Let's finish this. There should be an electrical room with military generators further below. Look for an elevator. Maybe you can go down the shaft. What are military generators doing in the metro? Seems the tunnels work great for moving troops around the city. Only first they had to clean the infected out. And to do that, they needed a lot of light. That called for a lot of power.
Nicholas, it worked. Generators are up and running. So the intel wasn't some booze-induced fantasy. Now get back up here. I got some beers on ice with your name on them.
heard the renegades killed a group of children. Get out and find him, Aiden. I'm impressed. Honestly, I didn't expect you to go all the way down. I finish what I start. Luan was right. You're one tenacious son of a bitch. What else can I do you for? How do you know so much about military installations? I'm a bartender. I'd get GRE guys in here, incognito of course. Military brass trying to lie low, even big shot ministers of whatever. After a few generously poured shots, they all had stories to tell. I learned about the Metro Generators from the skittish guy in glasses. The retired history teacher type, all buttoned down, needed to spill his guts to someone. Later, they hanged him for war crimes. Where'd that chemical gunk I ran into come from? It was created to fast forward the infection to the terminal stage. Basically kill the infected with a form of premature aging. Wasn't supposed to have any effect on the healthy or recently bitten, like you and me. But it didn't work out that way. So that's why my biomarker goes crazy when I get near it. Yep. But that's not the worst of it. Some say the military knew how lethal the stuff really was. Suited them to finish off every last one of us. Why? Only the Colonel knows, but the old bastard never leaves his fortress. But if you really want to know the truth about the GRE, just check out their labs. They're scattered all over town. Lord, the shit that must have gone down there. I gotta go. Thanks, Aiden. With skills like that, you'll find plenty to do around here. But watch what you get yourself into. Watch yourself, you hear? like a rodeo.
Apple of Saving. This Save your booze money and shop here. Hear more.